All right, so this is with the system not pegged to a single plane. You can see when I move the laser that it bounces off different things, and also that if I tilt it, it also changes where it hits on that other board, the other reflector. And the problem with this is that sometimes you actually do want everything to fall in the same plane, partly because we know that when they're sitting on a flat surface like this, they all should be. So I have a button over here that when I push it, it instead uses the position of the three different uh, trackers in order to define a plane and then everything is locked on. So now, you see that if I tilt this, it still stays fairly well in the plane. And it's jittery, of course, because of other reasons I discussed in the post. But that's kind of the difference between using the plane and then Notice how it kind of sometimes overshoots the uh, laser tip, and then when I put it on the plane, it never overshoots the laser tip because it's locked into the position, or locked into the plane correctly. So yeah, you can move any of these around. If it loses track of one completely, it just defaults back to using two. Bring that one back in. Nope, now it's got all three. Alright, that's it.